I always thought that phrase was kind of... No! No! Man, I got jumped. Why all of a sudden did everything just get so hard? <laughs> Ugh. I gotta go to the drugstore and get some more money. Wait a minute, there should be a, an ATM in the hospital, shouldn't there? Oh my god, why did everything get so hard all of a sudden? Good lord. Where's the ATM machine, man? I gotta, like, revive my friends. I just met Harry, and, like, I let him die. That's just- No, I didn't want to go downstairs, good sweet Jesus. Oh my god, why is everyone dying? Everyone I know and love is dying! That is not where I want to go. Isn't there an ATM in the hospital? It would make sense if there were. Oh my god. Zombies got me. I should have gotten some zombie insurance. Okay. Oh my god, there's not even an ATM in here, and I'm gonna walk outside the hospital and get jumped. Jump to. And I'm gonna die. See, they're sitting right there, waiting for me! <laughs> I'm stuck! Aha, they're not here. No! 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 This is making me so nervous. Where's the, where's the drugstore? That's pizza. Oh, thank God. Come here. Oh. I'm so scared. Guys, I'm so frightened. Okay. I think I'm overcoming this. <laughs> Everything just got really hard all of a sudden. It's like, <laughs> oh my god. I, can I make it back to the hospital without dying? Hold on. Is there something that I can get here that will like... Oh, please, yes. I need two hard hats. Yeah, Katie's gonna carry that one. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, that's fine. Go ahead. Take the Holmes hat. I don't care. Yes. I'm just like in a frenzy. I'm just like going crazy. That's why my... Uh, what am I talking about? That's why my commentary is just like ridiculous. Because it's like I can't even like focus or concentrate. Because, like, I'm being followed by the ghosts of my friends. Yeah, go ahead and buy the Holmes hat. Yeah, go ahead. Yes. I think the copper bracelet can help. Yeah, the copper bracelet will help Harry. And we need all the help we can get. Yeah. Yes, we're gonna, like, equip it here. Okay. No, 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 no. No, and I need to get a couple more hundred dollars from this thing so I can, like, pay to revive my, uh, my friends. Jeez, all of a sudden everything just got so ridiculously more difficult. And you'd think that, like, with more party members it would have gotten easier, but no, that's not the case. Hold on, let me, let me just save real quick. Well, hold on a second. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna save it in slot two. I'm like, ugh. Picked up the receiver. What's going on? Um, let's call mom. Split, don't say a word. I know exactly what you're thinking. My son, who'd have thought he was such a brave kid? Oh yeah, you're a hero, honey. Okay, that's fine. Apparently I'm supposed to call back my mom every now and then. Otherwise, like, I'll get homesick or something. Okay. Jesus, I made it back to the hospital without, like, dying. Please. What? No. Do you want- who do you- who do you want to see? I want to see Katie. Yes. Yeah, that's fine. That, that's perfectly okay. And I need to do the same thing for Harry. I'm sorry, Harry, I didn't mean to kill you. Whichever Harry which, uh, wants to uh, take this one, you know. 
No, 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 no. That's not what I'm talking about. Harry. I want to revive Harry. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, thank God. We don't have that nasty, terrible blue... I mean, uh, red... Whatchamacallit, uh... Border around our menus. Okay, I'm saving now. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Everything just got so much more difficult all of a sudden. I don't know what to do, though. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do now. Oh, I guess I could go see what that... No. You, you do not exist. <laughs> you be gone. Yes, exactly. I'm sorry, but I think you ought to leave now. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've seen you before. Where is that hint place? Isn't there a hint place? I thought there was a hint place. No, but there was multiple buildings with that. No, I do not want to deal with your kind. I do not want to deal with your kind. Oh my god! Oh my god! I have to go see- Well, that was a little inconspicuous. Let's, um, talk to this guy. Shh, don't talk too loud. Yeah, I want to buy something. I want to buy the toy air gun. That was a rust promoter. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's get this toy air gun. Who's kind of lugged this around? Um. Yeah, okay, we'll get... We'll get Katie to carry it, since she can definitely use an air gun. Yes, I know, that's fine. Yes, I'm intent on purchasing it, jeez. Yeah, okay. Um. I guess I want to, uh... What am I gonna do with a ruler? Um. Give this to... Katie, so that Katie can give the toy air gun to Harry. Man, this is so complicated. And now Harry can equip the air, the whatever, the toy air gun. <sighs> that was a lot more complicated than I thought it was gonna be. Anyway, so. These guys rushed into the circus tent pretty suspiciously. So next time on Let's Play Earthbound, we're going to go check out and see what's in this earth tent. Earth tent? Earth tent? Circus tent. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Okay, and by uh, next time on Let's Play Earthbound, I meant to say let's keep going because it's in the middle of an episode and I don't want to upload a short episode. Anyway... Let's try this one more time. This is the second time that a recording has failed, but um, we're gonna try it again. By the way, um, I stayed the night at the hotel and Harry fixed something for us. He fixed, he made a slime generator. So, but first of all, I wanna check and see what a bottle rocket is gonna do. <laughs> bottle rocket, items for Harry. Damages an enemy when using a user. Okay, okay. Okay, I'll use the bottle rocket in this, um, battle um yeah i wasn't sure what to do so i just uh it, it has to do with this tent but it looks like it's facing the other way and like what's what we're seeing is the back of the tent so i was gonna go into the tent like this no that's not what you're supposed to do because that doesn't make any sense at all you know what does make sense this this makes sense what <laughs> yeah gaorg yeah, but you're not going to be able to hear my, like, first reactions. And it was good commentary, too. Okay, now before he uses this stupid technique, I'm going to go ahead and use PSI Movies Beta. Before he uses the most retarded technique ever. And I'm going to use PSI Freeze. And I'm going to use a bottle rocket. And he's going to die! That's right. 22 points of damage. That's not that bad. Movies Beta! Shaboodles! Oh man. That is really gross. Oh, Harry! What? Oh, okay, he moved freely. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do PSI movies again. Because we can. And PSI. Uh. Freeze. 
And then, let's try to use the bottle rocket again. Let's just try. Man, we're going all out on this guy, aren't we? Do it! Freeze him! Yay, he's solidified! He's frozen now! Whee! He's gonna die! Because the first time I did this, it was just a bludgeon fest. And, uh... Oh, pff, I thought that was gonna be a cool animation. Oh yeah, he went down a lot easier this time than he did last time. Because basically he used this move that w uh, let us... Oh yeah, Katie's not at 14. Basically he used this move to where, like, um, you can't use PSI moves. Or you can, but it wouldn't do any effect. So I wanted to go ahead and just use all my PSI moves before he used that move. So anyway... It's a trash can and some zombies! Well, of course, we must dig in the trash. <laughs> Let's see here. I love that so much. A jar of a fly honey? Okay, that's fine. That's good. It's good with me. All right, let's walk around and do some crap. Yay. Well, I know what's about to happen, but I'm not going to ruin it for you guys. <laughs> or you probably already know what's going to happen, too, so whatever. And now... Hello, this is Apple Kid. I just wanted to let you know that I finished a pretty unique invention. I'm sure if uh, it'll help you or not. I'm not sure if it'll help you or not. It's called zombie paper, and it can be used to trap zombies. Oh, how about that? It works kind of like fly paper. <laughs> All you need to do is place the paper on the floor of a tent or something. You've seen at least one tent around, right? Maybe? And then zombies get stuck on the paper. When they move around inside the tent, you can catch a lot of zombies this way. In fact, I bet you could get rid of all the zombies that are terrorizing the area with this paper. That's nice. Anyway, I just asked the mock pizza delivery man to deliver the, pa the zombie paper to you. Split? You should get on it pretty soon. I've never actually seen a zombie, but if they are, if, really, if, if there really are any, I don't know why I was unable to read that sentence, zombie paper would be very useful. I'll be calling you if I come up with anything else. Click beep! Man, you are so useful, Apple Kid. So all we gotta do is just walk around really quickly and... Mock policeman? Mock policeman? While delivering pizza, this weird guy asked me to help him out. He wanted me to deliver this to someone named Split. I'm someone named Split, who's walking around Threed. I'm wandering around Threed. No one else knows about this, right? I guess not. Let's just pretend that you're Split, and I'll give this to you. Well, you don't have to pretend. I'm Split. Oh, hello, Split! Just go along with me on this, okay? Well, you don't- Okay, fine. I made the decision that you're Split no matter what. <laughs> oh my god, that reminds me. When I was a sophomore, um, and I saw this freshman, it was the very first day of school, I saw this freshman wearing a Pink Floyd shirt, so I was like, you must be pretty cool. So I talked to him, and he's like, my name's Matt. And I'm like, you know what? You don't look like a Matt. You look like an Andrew. So I called him Andrew ever since, and he didn't have any problems with it. So I was like, okay, that's fine. Split got the zombie paper! That's right, Split. Wink, wink. I've done my duty and given you Apple Kids thingamajig. Well, goodbye. You know what would have been crazy? I mean, he could have walked up to, to this Joe Schmo and been like, you're Split, have the zombie paper. Or this Joe Schmo. I'm just glad that he walked up to us and said, hey, have this zombie paper. What an irresponsible p delivery man, jeez. Alright, let's go ahead and lay the zombie paper. Um, Funny enough, zombie paper is invisible. <laughs> Either it's invisible or it's like the color of tent floor. <laughs> what do these guys have to say? Just imagine when we wake up tomorrow morning, ugh, it'll be really gross. Yeah, you're right, it will be. Hello, fat man. Hey, 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 stupid zombies, come on over. Hello, lady. Here, zombie, zombie, zombie. I have a nice bone for you. That's weird. Hey, stupid zombies, come on out. Come out wherever you are. Suspense is killing me. All the yucks and free. Oh, hello, man. You can do whatever you want. Just save my life. You can have my piano, my left leg, and my wife. Okay. Zombie paper is a stupid product name. You're right, but as long as it works, it's no big deal. Alrighty then, guys. That should be the end of that episode. I will see you guys later on Let's Play Earthbound. Bye!